What's Gucci YouTube? It's your boy Young Mike, back at it with another five video. I don't know if I don't know if y'all been keeping up for the past couple of days, but y'all said I needed a new alternator because I was waking up to a dead battery every morning. So yesterday I replaced the alternator, and here's the final test. We're in the morning. Everything's machines working wise. Every light's working perfect. Now ready, set. Cold start. But what y'all think, man? What y'all think? I think we did it, bro. I think because it... Every morning, bro, my shit wouldn't start, bro. So I think we did it, bro. But as y'all can see in the title, man, this is this time about how I met Tay K. Um... I thought I should mention it now because, you know, he's all famous and shit, so it'll be kind of cool for y'all to hear that story. So, it's working, bruh. We fucking did it. We fucking did it, bitch. Oh, man. That was actually my second time turning it on. I just didn't. I don't know. I didn't think it was going to work again, but who the fuck would have knew it was an alternator? It's a bad diode. A bad diode could drain your battery even when your engine is off. So y'all always remember that if y'all having the same problem, make sure that you check your diode. There's ways to check your diode, but I have no clue how to do that. But anyway, you guys, um, let's explain to y'all. My cats are hungry, but they're gonna have to wait until after the video. All right? That cool, bro? You, that cool? Bet. Say no more. Say no more, can't foe. Come on, little homie. Come on, little homie. Little dude. Little dude. All right, we about to spark up, though, man, and explain how I meant take K, hey, bro. The legend. All right, you guys. Let me see if I can set this shit up somewhere. I'm trying to set y'all up somewhere. You dig? You dig? Bro, it's fucking legit cold out here, dog. Like, legit. Bro, I don't even know where to put y'all. Cool. I see a place right here, boy. Right here, Buster. Alright, I hope y'all can see me. Alright, you guys, so... Take K, man. Shout outs to my nigga Take K, bro. Uh, I didn't even really... I didn't really get to meet him. Meet him, like, shake his hand and say what's up. Like, tell him my name and shit. Damn, it's cold as fuck out here, guys, but... I'll explain to y'all what, what happened. All right, you guys, so look. I think this was, uh, let's see, it was 2016 I got out. Um, wait, 2017 I got out. So this was 2016, guys. Um, 2016, probably like the beginning, beginning of the year. I was um, doing my business, you know what I'm saying? I was doing my thing out here in these streets and shit. And a lot of people come from out of town and they come out here, especially where I'm at, Northside, and they come and buy shit, you know what I'm saying? They come out here to see what's going on and they're not about to go to some dry ass places. Like, you know what I'm saying? I hate to say it, but like when you go out there in the southwest and maybe even the east sometimes you 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 tend to find a lot of people that are trying to rob a lot of gang bangers you tend to find a lot of broke niggas more than rich niggas over there for sure but when you come to the north side you see a lot of rich people a lot of non robbers like it's really different out here it's really different it's really really different so this was like a, a number one spot and I'm glad that I got to meet him before this happened, you know what I'm saying? 
Well, not really meet him, but y'all know what I mean. So, long story short, Tay K, couple of his homies or whatever. I don't even know if they're with him or not, but they're with him. I don't know if they're his homies or not, but pretty sure. Anyway, so Tay K, well, whatever his real name is, uh, came out here, right? Trying to buy some weed, son. Now, unfortunately, I didn't even get to meet him or like sell to him or anything like that. But like, what I did get to do is get to see like Tay K in person, like right in front of him while he got served some gas. You know what I'm saying? And this is the thing this is how I found out about Tay K. Okay, because, you know, you serve someone gas, you serve someone gas. It's not even nothing, you know what I'm saying? You never even think you get to see that person again type shit sometimes. Especially they're from out of town, you know what I'm saying? So this is what happened, bro. I, I get locked up for seven and a half months. I come back out. And I'm hearing Tay K this, Tay K that. And I'm like, bro, who the fuck you talking about? I don't know who Tay K is. Homie's like, bitch, yes you do, nigga, what the fuck? He's like, don't you remember, nigga? He's like, look. And he put on the race. And I remember seeing that face with the braces. And I remember seeing, like, remembering that nigga, bro. And I was like, damn, this nigga came up. And the, the race wasn't even at a million views yet, guys. Just, just so y'all know. So I was like, damn, this nigga's coming up, bro. That shit crazy. And then, um, yeah, man, this shit. He's all, he, my homie's like, yeah, man, this nigga is stupid as fuck. This nigga done. Beat us a nigga that's caught a body. And now he's on the run for that shit, bro. And now he's making music on the run. I'm like, damn, that nigga savage, bro. And he's like, you, you, like, I don't know, nigga. It just kind of hit me, you know what I'm saying? It was like, damn. That's that same little nigga that bought some, some dope, you know what I'm saying? That's that same little nigga, dog. And now that nigga up there, bro. It's crazy how that transaction happens, bro. He didn't get famous until he got arrested. He didn't get up there until he actually got arrested and was getting charged for that case. That's when everybody started making remixes and everybody started shouting them out even more. And that's when this shit just went viral as fuck. You know what I'm saying? The race song went viral as fuck. And for me to actually know him before any of this shit happened, it's pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the people that, that are Tay K's homies and shit watching this video and they're probably like, damn. You know what I'm saying? I remember that, or I don't know if y'all were with him, but yeah, man. 2016, man, Tay K came out here, San Antonio, Texas. Um, that shit is cool, though. Like, I always thought I should tell y'all that because it's it was crazy how I got out of jail, and out of nowhere, everybody's saying Tay K this, Tay K that, and then I told him like, well, "What do you mean, who's Tay K?" And then he's like, "Nigga, you don't remember, nigga? Look." Remember this nigga? And I was like, oh shit, nigga, I remember this nigga. Like, this shit crazy, bro. And like, I just see that as all these people out here. All these people that get famous out here. Like, imagine the people who remember them before they were famous, bro. Like, this is fucking ridiculous. It's pretty cool that, you know, let's just say I get famous, you know what I'm saying? If I keep on working hard and keep on grinding, I know I'm gonna get there, but like, let's just say I'm an overnight sensation, right? All y'all gonna be like, bro, I remember this man when he had nothing, bro. And now he driving in a Rolls Royce, got a mansion, he got hoes, bro. Like, that's what, like, for real, bro, that's that's how it's gonna play. you're gonna be like, y'all gonna be like, damn, I remember when, when nothing was happening. And damn, and now look at it, you know what I'm saying? So, we're gonna keep on grinding hard, keep on working hard, keep on doing what we gotta do. Free Take K, free Kodak, free all my peoples, man, free all my peoples locked up. Um, yeah, man, but like, take K, bro. Now, I just wish him the best. Uh, I hope he could get out soon. I hope I hope he watches this video, bro. He probably like that. I remember this nigga, bro. I remember this nigga, bro, because I did have my gold grill in, and I did. I was I was slinging, but like, like anybody who's out of town, they came like on the north side, you know what I'm saying, type shit, and they bought some shit, bro. So it's pretty cool. Like, I wonder who else I'm going to see that's just going to make it uh, from out of town or something. But yeah, man, homies was like, in the comic sections, there was like, yeah, you and Slim, that shit going to be live as fuck. Bruh, Slim Jesus, bruh, that's my nigga, bruh. 
hands down, my nigga, that's my nigga, bro. Like, he, he's real as fuck, bro. Like, honestly, he one of them real rappers out there, bro, that, that are really real, nigga. Like, because all these fake-ass rappers, bro, they never want to be responding to a nigga, bro. But, like, I'm a real-ass nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm one of them real-ass niggas, bro, that why not respond to, you know what I'm saying? So, I hit up Slim. And my homie hit me back up, bro, and we 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 might be working on some shit. It's all up to me, though. You know what I'm saying? We might be working on some shit. It's all up to me. We just gotta make sure. I just have to make sure I have a visual with it, and we're gonna be live as fuck. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna we gonna drop some Texas heat, all the way from Ohio to Texas, my nigga, or all the way from Texas to Ohio, bro. Like we doing that shit. But I'm stuck smoking this man wait for the weed man to get stocked up and my girl canceled on me. Said something else popped up, but I can't get with my ex now cause the ring finger all rocked up. Damn. Yeah man, fuck bro. I got a fucking I, I'm glad the car works, you know what I'm saying? I'm glad I fixed that problem. But now what I gotta do. It's fucking, I gotta do laundry today. I gotta clean up my room. What the fuck else I gotta do, bro? Probably clean, no, I cleaned the inside of my car last night. Uh, Y'all already know what the fuck going on, man. I'm gonna get busy as hell. And it's cold as fuck, bro. It doesn't help, it's cold. But anyway, guys, thank y'all for watching. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. I had to make this video. Regardless if it's not interesting or not, I feel like it was pretty cool to meet. Not, I don't know. I think it, I think it's pretty cool that I met him before the fame. To see actually, to see him actually before the fame, was pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? And then to come out and be like, this nigga's going blowing up, bro. And it's like, damn, that Texas shit, bro. That shit's really real, bro. Like, everybody fucking with Texas, bro. Like. San Antonio, Texas, that's where I'm from, 2-0, Dodie Gang shit, you know what I'm saying? You look up Dodie Gang, that's me, straight on the cover, bro. Dodie Gang shit, bro, 2-0, Texas, man, you already know what the fuck going on. Shout out to everybody from Texas, bro. Y'all know how to fuck we rock it, bro, but 2-0, man, we gonna, get, we gonna get on the map. I see fucking Blake, you know what I'm saying, trying to do his thing. Um, you know what I'm saying, other rappers out here trying to do their thing, bro, but y'all niggas ain't putting 2-0 on the map, bro. Y'all niggas ain't, bro. Like, if you hear half of my songs, they all speak of 2 0 San Antonio, Texas, bro. You hear half of these rappers out here, other songs, and all you hear about is bitches and money that they don't got. You know what I'm saying? Like, me, I'm going to be real with my raps. You know what I'm saying? If y'all call me out on one of my raps, I'm going to be real with it. You know what I'm saying? It, it's not going to be like I'm making this shit up just to be cool, head ass. Or I'm going to try to be a savage to get a record deal, head ass. No, it don't work that way. I'm really out here living these, these these words that I speak, you know what I'm saying? Like, mama really out here, you know, struggling. My grandma out there, you know, taking care of um, my little bro and shit. Like, it, it, it's hard, you know what I'm saying? We, I grew up without a dad. I grew up without a dad, bro. My mom wasn't always there because she was, you know, out of it, bro. And, um... Yeah, my grandma had to take over, bro. And my grandma's my grandma, bro. So we put all that stress on my grandma, dog. That's why for Christmas, bro, you watch out. My grandma need to watch out for Christmas, bro. I'm finna come behind that bitch with a bow on some shit. With a bow on some shit. But yeah, man, Texas love. Y'all already know what the fuck going on. Once people here, I'm from 210 Texas, bro. And they see the visuals and they like it. I know that's much love, bro. I'm blowing up every comic section in every rap video that's dropping. And I'm becoming one of the top 10 comments on each fucking video. Y'all y'all don't believe me? Y'all go check that shit out, bro. Each fucking comic section, bro. I'm top 10. I'm top 10, bro. 10 top 10, bro. That's how you come up, my nigga. When they fuck with you from every genre, my nigga, they fucking with you heavy, bro. Top 10 comics, comment likes. In every video that I put a comment on. I put a comment, three question marks. That shit got 600 likes. And it's the most viewed. It was the most liked comment in the whole fucking World Star video. 600 likes, bro. That's it. That's it. And I just put three question marks. That was the most likes in the whole video. 
damn, they fucking with your boy. That's all I put was three question marks. Someone put yesterday, damn, how'd you get all these fucking likes for just putting this shit? I'm gonna start doing what you doing. Like, bro, I honestly didn't think that I was gonna get no likes, bro. I put three question marks because I was kind of lost in that song. I was like, is this for real or is this for fake? So I just put three question marks. Bro, that shit blew up, bro. These niggas liking that shit back to back. Like, this was the most liked comment in that whole bitch, bro. I tell you. But that's the shit that I'm on, bro. I'm on that virus shit. When Gumo came out, when Gumo first came out, I said, no, no, no. It was the Fetty Wap and Gumo. Some shit like that. I don't fucking know. But I put who's ready for the for this for the gay remix, right? I put that. But like it's it's not like not on no gay shit, but like that shit got like two point eight thousand likes, bro. I was the top five in the whole Gumo or whatever the fuck came out, bro. And you know that shit went fucking platinum gold, whatever the fuck. So that's just what's up, bro. Like I fucking literally Literally, nigga, just put some stupid shit like that, and it just blew up. My channel started getting subs from other people. I started getting, like, endorsement deals and stuff like that. But did I take them? Fuck no, because they're, like, lame as fuck. They talking about some petty-ass money. So I'm not about to do that, you know what I'm saying? I'd rather start my own business, which I was doing. I was going to do $15 shoutouts. People were paying that shit, bro. Like, it was going to be legit. We were about to stack up and do better for the channel. You know what I'm saying? And then maybe stack up and buy merch and then y'all could buy merch and still get shout outs when y'all buy the merch. You know what I'm saying? So it was going to be all planned out perfect. But um, YouTube, we were going to ham on it and they seen that. So they're like, bro, if this man gets a million subs, bro, what are we going to do? Delete his channel, bro? Like, so they they knew I was I was aiming for that million subs, bro, and they knew I was going to get it too. Um... They just set me back, bro. Minor setback for their major comebacks. Y'all already know what's up, man. Make sure y'all go follow the IG. Lil Mike will make it. Uh, y'all go leave a like, and I'll follow back. Um, what else? What else? Yeah, man. Subscribe. Dodie Gang ENT. Savage Squad ENT. Um, more videos coming. Hood videos coming tomorrow. Hood video is coming tomorrow, guys. Make sure y'all like. Let's get this video to 1,000 views. And we got a hood video dropping tomorrow, guys. So thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for all the love, all the support. And I'll be back at it with some more fire videos. Okay.